click the bell icon to turn on notifications. Module 7-2, Set Up Reminders. In this module, I'm going to show you how to set up reminders within QuickBooks Online. For example, I'm going to show you how to set up a reminder to pay your monthly rent. When you have set up reminders, you're going to see them under the section called Tasks on your dashboard. We have a reminder set up in QuickBooks, therefore QuickBooks is telling us to respond to our recurring template reminders. Let me show you how to set up a reminder. To get to your reminders, you're going to click on the gear in the upper right hand corner. On the left hand side, under the option for list, you're going to click on recurring transactions. In the upper right hand corner, I'm going to click on the green new. I'm going to create a recurring transaction of an expense and then I'm going to choose OK. I'm going to give my template a name. I'm going to call my template rent expense. I'm going to change the type from scheduled to reminder. I'm going to say do this zero days in advance. I'm going to choose ABC Land Holdings. I'm going to say this money comes out of my account called cash. We're going to say this happens on the 27th of every day of every month. And we're going to say it starts with this month. For the payment method, it asks how we're going to pay. I'm going to say we're going to pay it on the credit card. We'd like the points. For the category, I'm going to choose rent. For the amount, I'm going to say $200. Now I'm just going to click on Save Template in the lower right hand corner. When you're creating a reminder for yourself, just remember the template name. That's going to be the name that you use to identify and locate this template later. The rest of this needs to all be correct as far as your accounting is concerned. When I click on Save Template, it takes me back to my list of templates or reminders. I set up a reminder for my rent. If I wanted to set up a reminder to invoice somebody, I could do that by clicking on New in the upper right hand corner. I can change the transaction type from Bill to Invoice and then click OK. I'm not going to do any of this automatic stuff because I'm just setting up a reminder for myself. This is going to happen, we're going to say on the last Saturday of every month. And we're going to say starting with today, Cindy, Cindy, and we'll come down and we'll say consulting. And what we're doing is we're just setting up a reminder once a month on the last Saturday of the month, we'd like to send out an invoice to Cindy for her monthly consulting. When we're happy, we'll click on Save Template. And there it is, it's on our list. When you look at the list, if it gets to be kind of long, you can always sort by clicking on Template Name, sort by type, transaction type, interval. You get the idea. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To get a free QuickBooks Online Essential Keyboard Shortcuts infographic, Click over there and click over there to watch more QuickBooks videos from Simon Says It.